Welcome to The Bracket, episode 117. Today, we are debating a very foul and disgusting topic. That was so unnecessary. What was unnecessary? That was more distracting. It was more, yeah. Just was, walk right across. more embarrassing. Bent to over to, to uh, hunchback to Mookie? not appear on. You were more visually disturbing, but trying to hide than just walking across. It was like That's just weird. as much of his body was involved in the shot yes. as if he just sprinted. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, today we're doing a very foul and disgusting topic inspired by the Dune popcorn bucket, which obviously went viral, which is just the most fuckable inanimate objects. Something that I think um, we probably thought about a lot more as when we were younger. Have you felt it yet? I don't think yeah. you've actually put your hand in, have you? Oh, yeah. It's tremendous. You, you'd have to have a really big dick to, like, fuck that to completion. No, nah, not that big. I take got for, one. Take like, it for your, a spin. Your dick would fit okay, I think. Not that <laughs> Thank you, John. Yeah. Uh, wow. I mean, it feels okay. Wait, like, if so you threw are we doing the most fuckable inanimate objects, or are we doing things you just want to stick your penis in? Because there is a difference in my mind. What? I thought we were all fucking objects together. It seems really similar. Yeah, what's the, Wait, what's what's the, the difference between yeah. fucking and sticking your penis in? There's You're <laughs> such a pig. <laughs> you really are. You, putting your, you could put your penis in, like, Laffy Taffy. I don't necessarily want to fuck it, what? but it would be interesting. Putting your penis in something? What? So wait, if your girl was what? cheating on you and she was like, no, he didn't fuck me, he just put his penis in me? <laughs> You're talking about you, soaking with laffy an animate taffy? object? What do you mean? Yeah, why laffy taffy? Taffy. Laffy taffy made no sense. It's a solid <laughs> object. It's a solid. I was, reaching, I was reaching for something and I said that. I meant to say a silly putty or whatever. Oh, okay. okay. We're talking That's about even that. The random objects. All right, fine. All right. I won't say anything. Maybe like flarp. <laughs> flarp would be, feel pretty good. Ooh, flarp, flarp would feel flarp good. I'm going to have to add putty. that. Yeah, uh, or phloem, mm. but I'm afraid to get that in my piss hole. All right, hot start for Grenda. <laughs> the, the beads of the phloem, you don't want that. You don't um, want phloem beads in your dick. Yeah, let's say know. things you, you, you'd put your dick in. How about that? Does that satisfy you, Junda? There's no difference. Yeah. Okay. There isn't. Are we debating what looks more fuckable or what we think would feel better? Let's say, I'm going to go with feel. Let's feel. I think feel is what we should be going for here versus looks. Uh, but before we get to that, let's talk from our good friends at Game Time. Which I'm sure they love this transition. Uh, you shouldn't have to worry when you're buying tickets to your next big event. Game time is the fast and easy way to buy tickets to all the sports, music, comedy, and theater events near you. Uh, we all here have used Game Time, I'm sure, at least once. Uh, use them for a ton of different events. So use for Panic at the Disco. You want to? You going to go see us in anything soon? Am I going to what? You go see anything soon with Game Time? Of course. Yeah. Uh, what's what's the? Well, I wonder what's on the Pat. What what music does Pat like? Actually, I want to use Game Philadelphia. Time. I, I want <laughs> the movie. Rent. <laughs> Dallas Buyers Who's, Club who, Live. Who sings the uh, YMCA song? Uh, Village People. Village People. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go see the Village People. They yeah, might yeah. all be dead now. I have no idea. Well, I mean, if they survived the 80s, yeah, they're if they probably alive now. Yeah. Uh, John Rich, anything you want to go see? Uh, Broadway shows. Broadway shows? Love them. You Trying like to get Broadway? back into them. Yeah, I kind of do. They're yeah. kind of great. Okay. Saw Neil Diamond one. That was fantastic. Moulin Rouge. Yeah. Great show. But yeah, make sure you check out Game Time. Last minute tickets, flash deals, zone deals. Easy to find and buy tickets of any kind of event in your area. They're not the only ticketing app that give you the complete peace of mind with your purchase. See the view from your seat before you buy so you know exactly what to expect when you arrive. All in prices show your total upfront so that you know you're getting a great deal without the hidden fees. Buy tickets in seconds with two taps. Take the guesses out of buying tickets with Game Time. Down the Game Time app, create an account and use code BRACKET for $20 off your first purchase. Terms apply. Again, create an account and redeem code bracket for 20 bucks off uh download game time today last minute tickets lowest price guaranteed uh we wanted to get a good panel of freaks on for this one so we obviously got meek phil on we got pad who do i feel like you get to you get a little freaky sometimes maybe you've, you've talked a lot about freaky stuff you've talked a freaky game well i, I mean you're gonna have to wait and see for yourself john rich you're a little bit freaky too i don't know if you are I, sometimes you just get the look i wasn't going to say this but i did shave my legs the other day why? 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 I just wanted to see how it felt. It feels awesome. How high up did you go? Like really high, like the whole way. Full shave? Are you going full shave? Oh my god! I got a big oh, cut right you now. You nicked him up? Yeah, oh yeah, I nicked him up good. Holy shit, dude! You got a big nick. What the yeah. fuck? No offense. This there you go. I got shaved nervous. legs. And then Rudy too, obviously, who's the big, the big sex freak. You once said that you think that all sex, penetrative sex, should last thirty minutes minimum. Insane. I didn't say it like that. I just said, I don't know why you want it to be done so quick. I don't know why guys champion wanting to be like, oh, I bust quick. They don't like, champion that. Yes, they do. They're ashamed of that. No, yeah. they do it ironically, and they're like, oh, yeah, like three minutes is all I got. Yeah, it's that's like, true. Why would you yeah, that, that, that's kind of been beaten to the ground, I think. Yes. Uh, every once in a while, a nice 30 minutes is probably. Yeah, once in a probably. while. That's not an every session deal, I don't think. No? No, I mean, I've definitely busted quick. <laughs> Oh, quote, card, quote carding that. that uh, yeah. 
But yeah, let's get into it. Sexual objects, inanimate yeah, objects. Yeah, I guess if I have to, if I really think about it, yeah, I've probably busted quick. <laughs> <laughs> You're such an asshole. Oh uh, yeah, the mission. Uh, I hate when you do ad libs to my sons. I never said if I really think about it. <laughs> I really, yeah, really adds really, a little bit to you to be always seem so whack. Yeah. <laughs> really set my mind <laughs> oh, going through the annals, annals of my brain. I mean, statistically, there has it's to fucking, be one. He's like the Jimmy Neutron, like going into his mind palace. Oh, when did I bust quick that one time? I mean, it goes through every neuron of your brain. Uh, yeah. Number five seed versus the 12 seed. Uh, the number five seed, uh, this one, I think you had to add only because it is uh, a bona fide fact that someone did fuck this inanimate object, which is a McChicken. I mean, oh, was, yeah. That guy did fuck it. And I'm not, I'll, I don't know. Do you guys want us, me to send in our chat the actual yes, fucked please. McChicken? Mm hmm. Do you have a video of him doing the fucking? Yeah, probably. Yeah, I don't have a video. I didn't send the video, but I did save. And I, at first, I just sent the regular McChicken. But I do. Have what a day at Barstool Sports that was of Chuck opening up that DM. Yeah. Of hey, just, can you post this? <laughs> yeah. Of the fucked McChicken, and then the fucked McChicken, and then that's going up against the number twelve seed. This was we thought of it very late. This is a very Chaps topic. I asked Chaps to give him a submission. He said the Coco de Mer seed, which he sent a picture of, and you'll seeing on your screen right now. Uh, which when you look at it, looks like. <laughs> Dude, he went other. He went opposite sides of the pond. Yeah, and just put his dick in it. Yeah, that dude. One dude <laughs> fucked him a chicken, and the other thing is that's what, is, what is and Pat, Pat just sent a mangina of himself. That's jelly. That's <laughs> not. That is not me. Joey just jelly. sent a mangina of it. <laughs> Does it make it better? Wait, it's a live photo. So, uh, yeah. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> that's what you call a hair diaper in the biz. <laughs> he makes it. He makes it taut. <laughs> oh yeah. no. Uh, but yeah, so we that's have a nice coffee table. Which that's one? Cal Cut a deer. <laughs> We have the McChicken, which someone did oh, fuck. We've seen incredible. a video of it, and that's going against Coco de Mer seed, which does look a lot like a fuckable object. Uh, we'll start with you, Nick. Which one of these things do you think would be more fuckable? I think that seed would feel really bad. It looks like it has some prickles right at the hole. Um, <laughs> juicy ass, no doubt, but this is more about dick feel. Um, mm -hmm. I think the shredded chicken, I don't know, feel kind of like confetti or, I don't know, probably... And then it's warm with also the colder mayo. It might be a, a nice, interesting twist of sensation. There's a grease I'll on it. I'll go McChicken. There's I'll a lot go of McChicken. Grease. One for the. I've never been with a never been with an Irish person before. Does <laughs> does the cock come with the McChicken? Does the cock come with the McChicken? That's a great question. You'd be the Joey Chestnut. <laughs> You'd be Joey Chestnut eating those McChicken. I'm sorry. I thought the cock was included. <laughs> uh, Junda. Uh, I do agree with Nick. Visually, this plant or whatever it is uh visually is bringing more to the table but it doesn't look like an inviting place for any penis uh, a lot of friction doesn't mm -hmm. look like there's any it's it's desperate for water of any kind the uh, mcchicken provides a little bit more of that the mcchicken would be grating the the fried aspect of the chicken mm -hmm. um however having said that there is you know bun which is soft the mayo i think mayo. Really. Mayo, mayo really puts it over the top, so I agree with Nick. I think the McChicken is a clear winner in this regard. Another one for the McChicken, KB. Yeah, what is this, like a Polynesian fruit? Some sort of fruit, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look good. It looks like it would feel like bristle and... It's just wood. That's all wicker. it is. It does look very uh, yeah, woody. The mayo is carrying the McChicken here. That's what's mm -hmm. getting you off. Yep. It's all may <laughs> The mayo will help. I think I'm going McChicken. I mean, the guy did... The guy fucking cummed from a McChicken. We, I saw the video. It happened. He cummed? Sent it in the fucking yeah, he, chat. Full completion for the McChicken. It was unbelievable. Yeah, I was, they always loaded up with a, too much mayo. Way too much. Meek and fail? I feel like the first few... Th uh, I don't want to really analyze this anymore. Never mind. Uh, hell, man. <laughs> <laughs> Meek Phil. I mean, I've never seen the second one in my life, so I'm just going to go with McChicken just because it's a lot hey, smoother. None of us. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, mean, I don't know what you've seen. Good point. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, the chicken's a lot smoother with the sauces, and yeah, you may be able to get off from it. <laughs> Some idea what you said is just funnier. I don't know. But the sauces. <laughs> Green. Another one for the McChicken. Is the guy in the second picture one of the options? I, I the trial? The, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I know. They, I think yeah, when, when KB said... Polynesian fruit. I thought he was referring to the boy in it. Yeah, <laughs> that Polynesian. How many fruit, Polynesian yeah. fruits have you yeah. seen? Have you yeah. met? It depends. I think. I mean, you got to go with the McChicken here. I think because you can like crumple it up. Like, there's no mm. rules against. You don't have to have like the hard part of the chicken on your dick. You can just crumple it up into like a paste. Yeah, that's true. And fuck the paste. <laughs> 
It's fucking foul. You fucked uh, the, not fuck the true, taste, though. dude. I kind of think you're all wrong because a McChicken is, it's what, a dollar? It's yeah. Like, not some, like, it's like some, okay, two dollars. Like some cheap American shit. Whatever the other one is, that's exotic. Mm-hmm. You saw the small African boy holding it. That'd be a story. Another notch, notch on the belt. Yeah, no, yeah, notch yeah. on the belt. Oh. I'm trying to think of a better mm-hmm. word for it. But Everybody's yeah, another notch on yeah. Everybody yeah. ate a McChicken. Mm-hmm. Nobody can fucked McChicken. Uh, whatever that other seat is. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, it's like a high-end escort yeah. of fucking inanimate objects. Mm-hmm. It'd feel terrible. It would feel much worse than the McChicken. Maybe but. it's one like one of those fruits that's like really gooey on the inside, though. You just have to have the reach to get there. Like a, oh, ban- like a banana. Find out. <laughs> like if you can get past like the... like you can, pr- It's like a prickly pussy. Yeah. Like if you can get past... <laughs> you that, if you got a really... I said there's only one way to find out. That's Damn, true. Damn, Phil. Yeah. yeah. If you yeah. got a really sharp dick and can get through the... You know, it looked like a pretty hard outer, a pretty yeah. hard outer crust. It might yeah. be kind of nice. Uh, the McChicken's going to move on. Almost clean sweep. Jarmich does go for the exotic nut. Uh, mm-hmm. Four seed versus the thirteen seed. The four seed is the warmed up hot pocket, which does seem like it's kind of meant to fuck a little bit. If you were to cut off the one end of the hot pocket, it does seem like it wouldn't be terrible. And that's going up as number thirteen seed. The inspiration for this bracket, the Dune popcorn bucket, which I do think the more. I thought that the, the tendrils of this thing was going to be like very hard plastic or something. It's very like soft rubber, and it doesn't feel bad. And I think if you throw throw a little lubriderm on that, it wouldn't be terrible. Dude, you you have to have a huge dick to fuck this. No, I it's know. Not obvious. As big, I don't think that's it's pretty. Show the whole of the camera. Show this the thing camera. is like there's nothing here. It's like your fucking air. No, yeah. that would get all sides of a hard dick. Pretty much. Not, but there's not enough, like, resistance. Pretty much. <laughs> well, maybe, maybe, put, maybe put some butter. butter. It might. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe yeah. put some butter in there? No, there's not enough resistance. That's... Yeah. Are, John Rich, how big is your dick? <laughs> not that big. I don't know. I feel like John, you guys John are John has a fucking insane. certified I not, I no sure don't. In. Yeah. I mean, this Phil, is, this uh, is pretty Phil, big. could you fuck that to completion? I, I don't... It's big. It's I don't got enough big. It, I don't got enough for this. It's pretty simple. It's like a foot long. Foot. No kidding. Like, yeah. you know, it's not the tight. Body. It's not tight. Like yeah, it's gonna come tightness. out very easily. Yeah. But like it, I, mean, I, th- I think gun to my head, I could get off. In but the, that's, in a, the that's a whole other fetish. Yeah. But that's the gun that's getting you off. <laughs> that's a whole other fetish. <laughs> Both. Whatever. Yeah. Without gun, with gun, yeah. I think I could get off on that if I needed to. Okay. I got so one of these. I got one at good home. Good to know. Really? Yeah. It's only a matter of time before. Just broke my other shoulder throwing that. Uh. So warm hot pocket versus Dune bucket, John Rich. Dune Bucket, I guess. The Dune Bucket is going to get one vote, Pat. Hot Pocket. But you can let it, cool, da- you can let it cool down first, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. You're going pocket. with the warm Hot Pocket. So yeah. are both objects full during this? Like, can I empty what's in the Hot Pocket? Can I empty what's in the Dune Bucket? Empty. Like, no great popcorn. Question. Question. Fuck popcorn. Great question. It's a phenomenal, phenomenal query. Uh, I think you got to say Trigger that you can. Warning. So you can't <laughs> empty it? I'd say so, yeah. I kind of want to go hot pocket. Go Damn. one for the another one for the hot pocket. Two to one, KB. I think the hot pocket has a higher potential for success and failure with the temperature <laughs> being of inconsistent. Um, it gets way too hot sometimes. Mm-hmm. It's in the name, to be fair. So, mm-hmm. would you rather that or the Dune bucket? Phil, you're saying not a chance with the Dune bucket. I don't have enough for that. Pretty simple. <laughs> Yeah, you, you, you're not enough girth, are you saying, to get to the I don't got, enough, I don't got enough meat for that. Uh, fair enough. All right. All right, yeah, I'm going the hot pocket then. Another for the hot pocket. Rudy. Yeah, KB is correct. Uh, the hot pocket is like a tidally locked planet where only one side faces the sun. It could be scorching hot yeah. in one place mm, would... and frigid on the other. But it does. the dune bucket does nothing for me. It's just a hole. Uh, and people have really ran with it, but you go in there if you if you break through, there's just an air. Yeah. So there's not a lot going on there. I think the you're going pocket. for the tendrils is what you're looking for here. Yeah. Yeah, but that, I don't. That doesn't really do anything for me. The hot pocket provides provides stimulation throughout. My vape uh, touches all sides of that. Your vape. Just for the record, my vape touches all sides. Yeah, but of that. your vape looks like what type of rig do you Megatron? Got? <laughs> yeah. it's not, I don't even have one of the giant ones. This is one, of those, one of those. Ones he smokes that a rig. Like a that thing is. How are you guys so opposite with this assessment? I think one of them just has a much larger dick. John Rich has a hog. There's just no two ways to put this. Believe you also don't need to. That's fuck not the even true. Of it. That's like, not even fuck, true. Like, the edge of it. I when I saw all, all the right. pi- when I saw all the pictures online, I was like, that's way too big for a dick. And then I bought the popcorn bucket, and I was like, all right, that's actually dick sized. Mm. Or how about let's make the voting based on how fast we could get which one we could get off faster to. Mm. I like that too. That would be easier. 
Well, like that, that changes too. it. That's well, easily hop on because you can hold on your hand. You're right. Mm. That's true. So, Jonah, are you going to stick with the warm hot pocket? Yes. My Let's mom. just change the topic to, like, best subject at school. <laughs> <laughs> the next the next option, yeah, I feel like, like, might change your mind. Uh, okay. Uh, am I up? Yeah. I'm basing this off of um, this one specifically of, like, what I would feel more shame afterwards, the post-nut. Mm-hmm. And I think it's real. <laughs> I don't know. Dude, I feel shame after eating a hot pocket. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that would yeah. be the Fucking one. Fucking one? Yeah. Fuck. Like, that's horrible, man. Like, you just have all the, I'm going to go Dude. dune bucket. I think the tendrils are enticing. And it would mm. be a news, it would be like a, a car wash for your, for your penis. <laughs> I think a good way to consider, uh-huh. too, is maybe which one would you least want, like, a video to go viral of you fucking, you know what I mean? Again, that changes no, but it the all. dune bucket would yeah. be awesome. That'd be hilarious. Yeah. You'd be doing it a bit. It would be hilarious and you couldn't see your dick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. That's Unless fair. it's depending on size. Yeah, that yeah. video is going to go viral. Someone's going to do that any day now. Yeah. yeah. Someone will be like hitting the back of a ten with theirs. But it I mean, probably mm-hmm. is already like, viral. A I'm video, find probably. It. A video of Meekville fucking a hot pocket would be viral in seconds. Like that would go be. I everywhere. would retweet. Oh, that. <laughs> What's yeah. it? Fucking Dune Bucket. Mm-hmm. That has to exist. There is, someone has done it already. I, I just exit out, out, out of a pottery sure. barn tab. <laughs> to open up that. People uh, really want to fuck the Dune Bucket. Either way, a hot pocket's going to move on. Eight seed versus nine seed. This I love this suggestion. Uh, the blood pressure cuff. So they, <laughs> blood pressure. What is that? God damn, like the, the thing, things like in Rite Aid or CVS where they take your blood. And it like closes That's up. good. That's, oh, yeah. And then this, this is an, another wild submission. Uh, a pile of fresh laundry that just came out of the dryer. Mm. Really warm laundry. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Imagine mm-hmm. having to like re just load the clothes. <laughs> Imagine I'm just put them right back in the washer because you just couldn't help but fucking your clean clothes. <laughs> the clean laundry. <laughs> it's just a vicious cycle. You would Every you would get time. caught in a trap. It's like those ants that just go in a circle yeah. until they die. You wash them, you fuck, you put it back in. By the time it's done, you're horny again, and you just gotta <laughs> fuck it again. You watch him. You're watching him get ready in the dryer. Yeah. So, <laughs> just watching the spin cycle, just like oh come on. Uh, so the blood pressure cuff versus a pile of fresh laundry. Uh, Nick. I'm going to go blood pressure cuff here because uh, I think you'd actually get some helpful information after it too. Oh, yeah. With your blood, can it measure your blood yeah. pressure with you go being actively fucking it? It measures the blood pressure of your it, cock? It does pulse yeah. and everything. Yeah. Well, are so you I letting think... it ride you or? <laughs> <laughs> um, I've already answered. I'm not... <laughs> How am I going to let the cup ride? <laughs> yeah, I have a question, Philip. Are you letting it ride you? Are you letting the blood pressure You tip over a 3,000 pound machine to get out of it. <laughs> In your world, this is like Toy Story where they have What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> it, it, the object doesn't become alive. Are you though. allowing it to ride you? If it gets really horny if and it wants it to wanted. ride you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you walk in on a blood pressure cup, ride me reverse. No hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! I mean, it's a good question. It's a good question. Would you top it? Like, what's the? <laughs> I, I don't. I didn't think it began that far. Oh, you're shit. not too fast. <laughs> yeah. We got to switch positions. <laughs> but I'm not too fast. Can you get on top? Stop! 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 stop. It's just beep, beep. <laughs> beep. <laughs> So, uh, well, so Nick, it can get on top and ride. So does that oh, change that your answer? That changes everything. It can fucking ride me. So it's one for the blood pressure. One for the blood pressure. No brainer. <laughs> Rudy, uh, I I was dead set on the laundry, but that completely flipped <laughs> the script. The ability of the you blood pressure wait, Rudy, to pump. Uh, you could put the laundry on, on top graphic, of you. By the way, a, a, a blood pressure cuff. Parentheses that can arrive. That can arrive. <laughs> <laughs> Rudy, you can put the laundry on top of you if you really want. Yeah, but can it, same. Can it, I don't know if it can do the same thing. I don't know if it can ride. It can just lay. Um, I guess I got to go blood pressure. Another full blood pressure cuff, yeah. KB. Yeah, I was thinking a dense, compact wad of fresh, warm linens and silks would mm-hmm. feel amazing, but. If the medical apparatus <laughs> could hypothet- ride my cock, um, that would be the ultimate this feeling. The old- so I'll go with the. We have to ask that for every item now. We got to know if it can ride us. <laughs> but we've had five items and Meek hasn't asked for any of those. Well, I don't know. I need why. to know. Were you assuming the other ones could? <laughs> or could it? I mean, some of them, sure. The hot pocket? 
<laughs> well, no, that can't ride it because it's too small. <laughs> I can't. Yeah, that's why, not because it's a fucking hot pocket. <laughs> yeah, so no, would you let it, it ride you? <laughs> like it's an itch if it yeah, really it wants, wants to. Like it asks. If it gets right. super horned up and it wants to ride it's you. It's too small. Like it doesn't reach the height requirement. <laughs> no, <just> ride. shit. <laughs> that's a, a, a Meek Phil. I got a blood pressure cuff for fresh laundry. A uh, blood pressure cuff. Yeah. Man. Oh, man. The whole time I was thinking like a prone bone. But yeah, the, the fucking... <laughs> God prone damn. Bone. <laughs> prone bone the cuff. <laughs> prone bone the blood pressure cuff. Uh, I'm going uh, I'm going laundry because I think the blood pressure cuff is like nylon and I think that would hurt your dick. Mm, that's fair. I guess so, yeah. Uh John Rich? Yeah. Um it's over now, right? I mean I would have gone laundry because <laughs> it's closest to like a couch cushion, which like everybody fucks when they're younger. Basically everybody? Yeah, most people try everybody. most people try to fuck a couch when they're younger. I don't think I ever fucked a couch. Wait, are you piercing the couch with your dick or in between, it, it doesn't, in it, doesn't the it doesn't work. But you're like, oh that that's like a crevice. Maybe that will work. You quickly realize it doesn't. You've put you your don't dick in a couch, couch before. For sure. Uh, yeah, I think I've, I've yeah. at least like thought about it strong. Of course. Thought about it. Okay. Heavily considered. That's <laughs> I've never I've you're never laying, you're laying there to take a nap. You kind of shift. You go, oh, there's a crack there. Yeah. Well, the blood pressure. You shove milk fees, milk, milk fills dick in it. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Uh, the blood pressure cuff's going to move on. Now we have the first plane, which is strictly meek submissions. So oh boy. just prepare yourself. <laughs> okay. It's just all our co workers. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> there are no co workers on this list. But they're all alive. <laughs> They'll be, be even scarier, to be honest. Um, the first is a bagel. Which like that's relatively tame, I think. You got the hole in the bagel. I just don't know how that in any way feels good. That's vanilla. Yeah. Uh, you also have a peanut butter. <laughs> Fucking a bagel is vanilla. <laughs> Everyone's fucked a bagel, dude. <laughs> then he has a peanut butter jar. Mm. Okay. That's, it's so solid. How hard is your dick that you could fuck peanut butter? Well, it depends. <laughs> It's fucking Stanley Cup. It depends. He's on the Stanley Cup next. Dude, well, I mean, it has a him. hole, doesn't it? The, the biggest hole in the world. Exactly. It's no different than the, the popcorn bucket. Yeah, but that has some sort of pressure. You put Stanley Cup? Yeah. The, the trophy? Or <laughs> no, like an actual yeah. Stanley. The Stanley Cup. No, I said it, a, a Stanley Cup. Which is oh. what you oh, what did You yeah. emphasize differently. You just wrote, <laughs> all I have written down for you is this, 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 I think it the Stanley Cup. I would have said the Stanley Cup if it was the Stanley Cup. I, Stanley Cup should be a fair. Stanley Cup. Uh, okay, that's fair. So you meant like a Stanley, like a steel Stanley yes. Cup. Yeah, how would you fuck that, Phil? I mean, go around the edges. <laughs> like a fucking like Tibetan go like thing. Like, 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 like one of those Tibetan meditation bowls. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so there's a sound, so there's a sound <laughs> bath of this cock. <laughs> I'm roommates with fucking Meek Phil, and when he's fucking that, like it aligns my cheese. Oh, yeah. that's, how you, that's how you summon girls to Target. Yeah, <laughs> just rubbing your dick around <laughs> the sides of a steel cup. You're f- <laughs> uh, electrical outlets. I mean, what? what? Yeah, why? suicidal. <laughs> I mean, yeah. How do you even get? <laughs> it's a happy ending, isn't it? Jesus, oh, Jesus Christ! That's oh. a really good point. Fuck, that's good. It's a happy ending because you get to kill yourself after. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> no, you just lose your dick. I don't think you die. You do. You, you could definitely die. die. Yeah, you Couldn't you die from sticking your hand in an outlet? Uh, yeah, but oh, you need yeah. a metal conductor, you can? don't you? No, I think you. Mm. I think if it were Phil, he would just be like Marv in Home Alone, where you can see a skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> uh, otherwise, unaffected. A disc drive. Yeah, like an Xbox 360 disc drive. So, like when it comes out. What? Yeah. And it has you just chop like the, your dick off. Yeah, it just has the, like the, the problem with that is it's, a, it's a rectangle. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. That's the, that's, there's way more problems <laughs> than that. Uh, a baseball glove. The, the real problem is the width of a CD. <laughs> well, some some people are smaller than oh. others. Yeah. Uh, a baseball glove. I don't know how that works either. Yeah, the, 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 where that you put your hand in the box. Yeah, that, that's not bad. That's not bad. It's fuzzy. That is bad. That's bad. Not Where, fuck a baseball. Uh, relatively was, speaking, I was better than I was those other like, ones. In, bet- in between, like the finger, okay. the webbing, doable. Oh no, the hand. I was thinking where yeah, the, the hand, hand goes because it's soft oh. in there. It's soft yeah. in there. Yeah. Sometimes they put fur in there, or like yeah, yeah. even more okay. comfy. Right. Yeah. yeah not um, bad. And then a warp pipe from Super Mario Brothers. What? Around the edges. Like the green pipes. Yeah, yeah. the green pipes from Super oh. Mario Brothers. 
Oh, that'd where be it teleports sick. your dick to another place. That'd be a pocket place. It probably has, a, it has some suction yeah. to it. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely has to. and sucks them into another dimension, literally. So among the Meeks chain options, uh, a bagel, peanut butter jar, Stanley cup, uh, electrical outlet, disc drive, baseball glove, and warp pipe. John Rich, one of those, which one of those do you want to see face the one seed? They were all bad, but actually warp pipe at the end. Because, again, has <laughs> suction to it. But mm. Yeah. Good one for cool. the, It's like a vacuum. Yeah. Which one, might be on this list. I don't know. One for the warp pipe. <laughs> I am going with the Stanley Cup. More for the Stanley Cup. <laughs> because if you yeah, have no. a Stanley Cup and you're fucking it, that means you're really doing well. Because you can't even get those cups anywhere. That's so the thought of getting the Stanley Cup would be would help push you over the edge while you're doing your dick sound bath. Prestige, mm-hmm. I get you. Yeah. Meek? Ah, uh, warp pipe. I didn't even think of the vacuum till John Rich said it. <laughs> the one for another for the warp pipe, KB? Wouldn't that be too uh, big? It depends on what You're, level it's sucking you to. Like the underwater level might feel good, but I wouldn't want to be like in Bowser. I want my tip being in Bowser's castle. It's like a molten. You, your dick yeah. would have to be oh. this, the width of Mario. <laughs> yeah, but the suction Mario. makes up for how big that. Is Mario? We, we have no idea. Life. I don't know because those those are like mushrooms that he's next I'm to. Tiny, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I've only seen him in like four pixels. He's the size big. of Manoli. <laughs> yeah, he is Manoli sized. <laughs> yeah, Manoli would be a great <laughs> Super Mario. My God. Then the pipe's a problem. Yeah. Hmm. So which one are you sticking with? I'm going um, bagel with schmear. With a little bit of schmear? Okay. <laughs> a lot of schmear, if that's okay. an option. Yeah, a lot of sh- <laughs> plenty of schmear. schmear. <laughs> yeah, as <laughs> much as possible. I can. Rudy? <laughs> uh, these are all so remarkably unfuckable. There's like no <laughs> serious issues. Like electrical outlet, there's nothing that even would fit your penis. The Xbox one, I still can't wrap my head around. Wow. The bagel would be coarse. Um... The baseball glove would be combining too many hobbies and pleasures. They're all just things Phil likes. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> yeah. You put that, yeah, you yeah, you put that together. <laughs> yeah. Um, Phil's trying to I, date so them. I have to go with the. I have to go with the warp pipe, even if we don't know how big it is. But at the le- very least, I experience a very important moment in video game history. Mm-hmm. And something no one's arguing. Or your dick before. does. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's one. It's all in one. One or all. Nick. I think I'm going to jar peanut butter. Jar of peanut butter. Melt, I forgot melt about it down. That. Yeah, that would be the best. Yeah, then the yeah. dog organic. can clean it up after. Oh, oh no. Oh. <laughs> it would have to be organic, I think, right? <laughs> I don't. As long as it's not chunky or crunchy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's true. The PB slash J, like the mixed one, would be nice. Yeah. Uh-huh. Not that nice, would be. Yeah, that would better. be better. Yeah. Is yeah. Bummer gonna have an issue with this on um, day five? Yeah, like something to fuck in his place. Or a little I don't know, uh, prison. I think, I think people talked about like the wet dream. Is that going to be an actual problem? I don't know if he's he too old to have wet for dreams. a forty-four year old man. No, nah, he could have one. Oh, you guys, definitely. you guys have wet dreams. Yeah, no, I do. I don't. You I do? Don't. Yeah, I do. Still? Yeah. I don't think I've ever had one. You Tom- come in your sleep. Yeah, probably once every yeah, couple no, months. Like once every couple, couple months, maybe months. three months. That's a lot. I'm probably that's too I, much. Ooh, I can't even tell you the last time I did it. Maybe once every two years. Yeah, I've only had oh, really? one. Fuck, Jesus. I've only ever had one. I, I I have sex dreams, but I just get too excited and I wake up. It's uh, very frustrating. Your sex dreams, you're just like eating pussy. I'm sure, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. And the chick is so hot. I get so excited. Mm-hmm. I just wake up because <laughs> I like her so much. Tommy, I think he said he has one like every three or four months too. Yeah, I know. It's a very weird thing. Yeah. At least in my he brain. He looks like that kind of person. That yeah. You can tell it on someone's face. That's sometimes. the most fuckable Someone thing I've ever seen. Someone being quiet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you said you don't, right? I. I... <laughs> it's a safe space. I don't know what that could nah, be. It's just, like, every night. Like, every single night? Two... It's either every night or never. <laughs> no, it's, yeah, I've, I've never Why had one. turning away from that? <laughs> He's like shamed. He turned God, away. I've never had a wet dream. Oh, okay. Really? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. No, we're not making fun now. We gotta get you one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How do we do that? Get you one. <laughs> next, next Jerry After Dark challenge. Yeah. <laughs> get get, get Meek Phil to come in his sleep. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> we can't leave the prison until he comes in his sleep. Uh, so the warp pipe <laughs> is going up against the number one seed, the water I snake. I love the one that that's what made Meek feel like shy and yeah. boy. <laughs> <laughs> He's like he wants to fuck a fucking cuff blood for blood pressure, but Ugh. and an Xbox <laughs> disc holder. Well, I was thinking of things in my head, like things that were in my bedroom and things that were in like the other room. <laughs> Just things in your general vicinity. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. You have a, a Mario pipe in your bedroom. 
<laughs> no, but I have a Yoshi Things figurine. That were in my room or the other room? <laughs> well, the other, the other room. Damn, like, dude, you were really thinking. <laughs> yeah, this, within two room distance of him. Holy shit. <laughs> what can I, That's where the creativity stops. <laughs> yeah, it's just like the world it stops existing after that. You said you had a Yoshi? Yeah, like a Yoshi, like a little figurine, like the size of that cup. Yoshi's gay as fuck. Well, I, I would feel bad I was gonna about say, that. I was going to say, you should have picked Birdo. I wish I had a Birdo. Oh, yeah. Birdo. Yeah, that's... Birdo might win this but it, whole thing. She's a person, <laughs> not an object. So the uh, warp pipe is going up against number one seed, the water snake, uh, the wa which I sent a picture Ooh. of in the chat. You just take one look at that. That was the thing that you... Kind of, I don't know how to describe it, but like it's a little gelatin thing that had a big hole in the middle, and you would hold it, you and could squeeze win it, for it like eighty tickets. Yeah, the arcade yeah, tracks, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, I was trying to remember the name of that to send it. I it was very difficult to find. It was yeah. so like actually had. I thought of that too, and I couldn't remember. I don't think I've ever seen this before. It's like a, they're it's really like, hard to carry. <laughs> It's like a yes. little hole. Yeah, it's like a little it, it, tube that just constantly stays in. Like you can invert it. Not it's, it's the wormhole. original pocket pussy. Yeah, Let's basically just call yes. it what it is. Yeah. So the water and you're seeing a picture of it if you're watching on YouTube. Uh, so or Rumble and they uh, that is going up against the warp pipe. Start with you, Nick. Which one do you think is more of a? F <laughs> come on, come on, move it on. <laughs> one for the water snake, Rudy. Yeah, the water snake. I mean, this has infinite lore on people fucking it. Mm -hmm. This it was a common thing where people would talk about fucking these things. I don't know what they, what are they are they meant to just be played with like Yeah, I think they're just like an arcade prize. They're just hard to hold. Yeah, yeah. they're they're slippery and like a devil's all, ball or whatever those things are called. Gelatinous. Yeah. yeah, that yeah, the snake, whatever. But if you think about it, they're pretty dry. Like you yeah. have to really Yeah. They're like it's, yeah. it's like hard, it's like that plastic and then cold. So I don't know, yeah. maybe it's warmed mm -hmm. up a bit. I don't know. But K the war pipe is two D. Yeah. Yeah. K B? Ooh. <laughs> It's 2D. <laughs> Sending in pictures of fucking Birdo. Yeah, no, Birdo. this is a top tier one. It's going to be the, the water snake. Another for the water snake, Meekville. I'm going warp pipe. <laughs> <laughs> it's just fascinating. The, the problem is there's no water snake in the room or the other room, so yeah. they can't, yeah. can't fit. There's a warp it. pipe in my mind. I've never seen the other thing, so. <laughs> I've, I've seen an actual warp pipe. I've never seen what you fair, fair. Okay. one scene yep. is. Fair. I'm going with the WS. The WS? Yeah, water snake. Yeah, it has to be water snake. Easy winner. <laughs> Before we get to the other side of the brackets here from our second advertiser, Factor. Love Factor here. Uh, eating better is easy with Factor. Is easy, uh, delicious, ready to eat meals. Uh, eat fresh, never frozen, chef crafted, dietitian approved, and ready to go uh, meals in under two minutes. Uh, you have over thirty five different options to choose from every week, including calories, smart protein plus, and keto. There are over sixty add ons to help you stay fueled up and feeling good all day long. So what are you waiting for? Get uh, get started today and get after your goals. We have two minute meals, feel fast with the restaurant quality meals that are ready to heat up whenever you are. Uh, pancakes smoothies whatever they got a whole ton of stuff uh no prep no mess meals factors are ready to uh heat and eat so there's no prepping cooking or cleanup needed uh flexible for your schedule we'll get as much as you uh or much or as little as you want by choosing your meals each week plus you can pause or reschedule it delivers anytime we talk about factor all the time i genuinely love them they're i think my favorite meal service i've ever used smoothies we talk about it every time we do a factor i was just gonna bring it up oh boy those smoothies are unbelievable they're so good and it, it legitimately tastes like two minutes in the microwave tastes like someone just cooked it right in front of you it's incredible uh head to factormeals.com slash lcb50 and use code lcb50 to get 50 percent off that's code lcb50 at factormeals.com slash lcb50 to get 50 percent off shout out to factor that uh that 50 percent off is like an insane deal. A crazy value. Like, that's yeah. actually like an insane deal crazy like, good value no sense to not get that you can't yeah. have anything 50 percent off now anymore so that's an it's an insane deal Mm -hmm. That was a great pitch. I loved that. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, it's just I love you. Like you went like full Billy Mays there for a second. Uh, <laughs> now we have the six versus the eleven. The six seed is the vacuum hose, which I think you just referenced. <sighs> Where uh, yeah. Rich, right? It never did it for me. Never tried it. I didn't have the one that yeah, had the detachable hose. So, uh, but that's going up against the number detachable hose is like a prostitute with like a pr prosthetic limb. Mm -hmm. uh, number that's going against the number eleven seed pumpkins. Which was that's one of yours. Mm. Uh, so the, there are some pumpkins. They come out every year. You'll see one where it just looks. You look at it and you're like, "That's a fuckable looking pumpkin." Uh, so we'll start out with vacuum hose versus the pumpkin, John Rich. Wait, can I clarify the pumpkin really quick? Yes, I was saying it's like a hole cut in the pumpkin. Yeah, well, yeah, 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 you get in the well, guts. Well, you're yeah. just saying it's a fuckable pumpkin, like a, just a raw pumpkin. Like, so well, it's literally fuckable it. if it has a hole in it. Got it. Yeah. Yeah, but the pumpkins, like, they look really fuckable when they're raw. <laughs> But like, if you actually want to fuck yeah. it, you just gotta like split their ass down the middle. <laughs> no, and the bottom of them does look like an asshole. It yeah. looks, but but you can't fuck that. Can yeah. you turn it into yeah. pie first and fuck it, or 
that's going to be a whole separate conversation you for later. Say? Say, hold on yeah, to that. That was a good huh. question. Mm -hmm. yeah. I think we go vacuum hose. Again, I don't think I've ever tried that, but <laughs> the suction, it's like a warp pipe, but like tighter. I feel like it's so something you'd remember if you solid. tried. Yeah. It's so scary though, because like oh, you don't know man. how much suction there is. What if it just fucking rips your dick off? Yeah. Hmm. It's so dry, I just don't know how that would work. It's part of the allure, maybe. You like the risk of it all. Yeah. Pat? Uh, pumpkin. You got to fuck the pumpkin. Got to fuck. I mean, the maybe pumpkin. maybe there's a bunch of guts in there, and you get a real real nice treat. D yeah, I sent a picture of a bun, by the way, which I was it was unbelievable. It's an unbelievable pumpkin in our mm -hmm. chat. There's just too mm -hmm. many unknowns with yeah. the vacuum. Meek, God forbid, it's a Dyson. I'm gonna go vacuum just because there's more risk and reward there. Whereas a pumpkin, you know what you're getting. <laughs> yeah, I guess you know what you're getting you know exactly. when you fuck yeah, a pumpkin. You know. We all know. We all know. man. Yeah. <laughs> Gibby. Gibby. Um. You got to go the item with the guts. I think the, the hose is just hard plastic. Yeah. No, yeah, I'm going the pumpkin. Pumpkin, we're two to two right now, Rudy. Uh, I'm, I, I have this weird thing with pumpkin seeds. I don't like them. The insides of them give me the heebie-jeebies. But objectively, it would feel better. And I also think there's something weirdly sacred about the pumpkin. I would feel bad for the pumpkin had I fucked it. They have this sort of humanistic quality. You could kiss part it. Of our culture. Uh, the vacuum is an inanimate object that if you fuck it or not, it, it makes no difference. It carries on with its life. Yeah. Um, or lack thereof. But I have to go with what objectively would feel better, and I'm going to go with the pumpkin. Another for the pumpkin, Nick. The worst part about fucking to completion is the cleanup, and the vacuum is just gone. Mm. Mm. Um, thank you, boys. Um, I'm going to go vacuum. <laughs> We're vacuum. Oh fuck! I have to tie break. Uh, I think that I would have to go with the pumpkin because I do think the gut feeling is what, like KB had mentioned, and that's what you're looking for, right? At least I think so. Yep. Yep. S Send it through. KB S likes to rearrange guts. Yep. Yep. The the big gut guy. I uh, just like with Taiwan Claxton. That's what you showed, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, so now we have uh, the number three versus the 14 seed. The three seed is the jacuzzi hole. So the jet stream oh, that comes out of the jacuzzi so scary, hole. Scary, dude. Mm. Yep. That warm air oh, just comes mm. billowing oh, Lord, out. Lord help me. Yep. It comes billowing out high speed. It's it's just there. And then that's going up against the hollowed out pickle that you use for like those weird corn dog things or whatever. That was submitted as well a couple times, which I did. Don't get it. Wait, why did you yeah, put both your arms up, Meek? I mean, this is just an easy the jacuzzi hole. Oh, I thought you were going to say easy pickle hole. Uh, so the pickle versus the jacuzzi jet hole. Let's start with you, Nick. I don't think this is easy. I don't either. So the jet hole's pushing out water. It's not sucking, yeah, right? Yeah, correct. Like, what correct. material is that? It's more so I guess just the warmth and the feeling of the jet. That's what's carrying, yeah. yeah. That's what's yeah. carrying, but I don't know. It would be put. It would be fighting you back. It's going to break your dick in half. Yeah. yeah. There's so much I'm danger. Going pickle. I'm going the pickle hole. One for the pickle hole. Rudy. Yeah, I think the misconception that it sucks comes from the movie Out Cold with yeah. Matt Galifianakis, <laughs> where he tries to fuck the German international skier lady who's very, very hot and bucks him, and he gets his peen. He, she denies him, and he decides to fuck the jacuzzi and gets stuck there, and then is stuck in the hot tub. All night. night. You're that, saying that's a misconception that it's... I Because he gets sucked in, but everyone knows that they push out. So I th maybe that's where it comes from. It's an old. But I mean, how does it suck in water to push it out? That's the yeah. Is that, there a suck hole somewhere? Dude, there has to be. be. Um, but having said that, even when I was a kid and I saw that movie, I didn't like the idea of that because it's machinery. Yeah. It's. Yeah. I, I, would feel, I would feel like when they insert you into the matrix. I feel like metallic. I get all twisted. Yeah. Yeah, metallic. Mm. There, you don't know what's in there. Plastic, grating. I don't like that. The pickle at least is forgiving. It's an organic item. Uh, so I'm gonna go with the pickle. Well, another one for the pickle, KB. Yeah, is this a? What do you mean? It's a hollow pickle? Yeah, I sent a picture of it in the. Uh, in oh, the, did you send a picture? Yeah. Um, think of like a bigger pickle, and it's it's hollowed oh. out. And it's, the, the way oh, I've seen them used is like they throw. A, oh yeah, this would be. Oh man, yeah, lovely. Give me the pickle. Oh no, hello. <laughs> you got grip too on the outside. Yeah. It does. That has a great grip. That's a great point. Uh, so three for the pickle, Meek. I really gotta be the first guy to take jacuzzi hole. You are. Like, I would never want to eat a pickle again after if I did that. Why? I mean, that's it's kind of horrifying. You'd be surprised. <laughs> Which of one all looks... the things. <laughs> yeah, I like I pickles. I never want to eat a pickle again. Wait yeah. until you hear about yeah, pussy. What are the other <laughs> options? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> 
<laughs> Wait to hear about women. As soon as you fuck a pussy, you're never going to want to fuck a pussy. <laughs> I'm still going jacuzzi, y'all. Dude, that's going to blast hot water up your dick hole. That sounds fun. I you mean, might, like, inflate. <laughs> <laughs> it just goes straight. It, it adds more intrigue. Like, pickle is a safe choice, but... The, qu the yeah. question with the jacuzzi is, can it ride? Yeah, can, can it ride? Yeah, can it ride? Turn, turn the pool over. Upside down. Uh, Pat. Pickle. Another for pickle. Yeah, that pickle just looked like a pocket pussy. It did kind of. Like, and you got electrolytes, wins. I guess, through osmosis or something? Sure. Maybe. So, pickle is going to move mm. on. Uh, we, you're shocked by this. I am shocked. But yeah. I, you said a lot of people put it in, so. Um, now we have the number seven versus the number ten. The seventh seed is the Boston Cream or Jelly Donut. Oof. I sent a picture of it. Boston. There we go. It's Oof. I mean, it's a good looking uh, donut. Mm. I gotta say. And that's going Looks up. Like it already came fucked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that's going up against the number ten seed, just pillows, which you, you mentioned before. People have tried to fuck pillows. You before. sent the big mouth photo. Uh, big mouth is a really weird show. It is it, correct. It makes me so uncomfortable. I agree. And a big what am I part of it. At? A big part of it was that character fucking his pillow. And it's got like the little hole thing. She got the for him slit. To see that? Yeah, it is. It's nasty. Uh, so that uh, the pillow versus the Boston cream donut, John Rich. Boston cream's more interesting. <laughs> I assume you can cut it in half. Why would you cut it in half? Because that's really li like you can't. Wait, what do you mean cut we it? We get half? it. You have a big dick, John. That's shot. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean cut it in half? Wait, what do you mean by that? I guess, I, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's like the same deal either way. There's cream on the inside. You're going to fuck it. That seems more interesting. It's got guts. <laughs> it does have guts. <laughs> I don't even remember what the other one was. It was a pillow. The pillow... I mean, I guess that's a classic one. But I I think... <laughs> the, the Boston... If I... The Boston cream donut probably wins. The Boston cream donut, Pat. I'm going with the cream donut. The cream donut as well. I don't get the fascination with pillows. There's no hole in them. Well, in this case, I guess you cut a hole in it, or... But that's more work, so I'll just go with the Boston cream. Well, you fold it. That, that's work. You're just trying to nut. Yeah, exactly. That is a lot like of half a calorie. <laughs> it's so much work. Meek, you wouldn't be able to fuck a donut... You wouldn't be able to eat a donut ever again. Yeah. I could live with that. that that's healthy. <laughs> <laughs> it might save That's his life. That would be a great diet that you just yeah. fuck every unhealthy food. <laughs> it's just, uh, yeah. You can't mentally eat them. I get McChicken back on the list. This man lost yeah. 50 pounds. What's his secret? He just fucks every unhealthy food so he can't picture eating it anymore. Uh, KB. Realistically, I would pick the pillow, but what has a higher ceiling? The donut. I'll go the donut. The donut? Mm -hmm. Rudy? Uh, my reason is weird, but I feel like a pillow... It, it, I wouldn't feel as much shame with a pillow and the donut for whatever reason I feel like has I would see donuts in the wild and I would feel shame yeah. and I'd feel gross and I'd feel odd I'd feel like a freak I'd feel like an outcast the pillow there's something personal about it it's my pillow whereas that donut didn't ask to be a part of my life I purchased it feels sort of gross so I'm gonna go with the pillow unless well, someone yeah. gifts you the donut <laughs> You're saying you purchased this donut? To fuck. <laughs> you're talking. You're talking like medieval here. Like have my have my daughter. <laughs> but would you feel? No. Sorry, would you feel comfortable sleeping on the pillow you fucked? Like yeah, so sleeping forward. Fuck pillow. Yeah, you yeah, fuck pillow. Yeah, pillow. Okay. You have a fuck pillow. pillow. Yes, I, you have to have a fuck pillow. An FP. <laughs> okay, so for the <laughs> one for the pillow, uh, Nick. I'm going pillow as well. Same reason as Rudy, I, but I, it's all for the shame. It's like fucking a hot pocket. You look down there, you have. Fucking donut on like that's pathetic. That's rock bottom. Yeah. At least a pillow is just like something that you share a bed with. <laughs> these are all rock bottom. <laughs> every one of these. Yeah, yeah every do not one fucking of these is things. rock bottom. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Uh, but I'm going pillow. All right, so the Boston Cream's gonna move on by a vote. Uh, last matchup of the day, 15 uh, C. This is the Rudy playing. So Rudy oh. had a lot of interesting options as well. First of which being the slushy. Mm. What? Yeah, I can well, see that. It comes back to what I said at the beginning. I was just thinking of interesting things to put your penis in. I wasn't explicitly thinking about fucking. That's them. cold. With the yeah, plastic, but it'd be an interesting sensation. With the yeah, dome that would, that on would it, hurt. No, I think just the slushy, yeah. just the just the actual slushy stuff, no not the fucking way. If you just, I had my headphones off. What's it up against? Uh, that's going up. It's this. This is the plane. Rudy's plane. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, after the slushy, we have quicksand. Yes. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And wow. after, after that, Forbidden. we have Baron Harkonnen's bathtub thing. So that you're talking about that black goop from His Dune, goop. right? Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. What so is this? It's like this big pile of black medicinal goop that a bad Got guy it. heals in. Um, it's like a mud bath mixed with olive oil. Yeah. Uh, oh. Very, very, very enticing. Next Lame. option is God. God. I don't, I, you said send a list. That's not an animate like, object. That's like a person. Be. It's a psalm. Yeah. It's, it's yeah, a, it would just be a legendary claim. It could be whoever you want it to be. God is a black trans woman. And, yeah, think about that, Rudy. <laughs> uh, wormhole. Mm. Yeah, not a worm as an earthly worm, but in space. It's kind of like you're similar to the warp pipe, to be honest. Similar, Very similar. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and then a black hole. Whatever one you want. <laughs> <laughs> And then you the can cats, go celestial or, or 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 earthly. And then the cats, um, eye nebula. The cats eye nebula. What's it's, a cats eye nebula? It's a, horrible. it's a it's a nebula in space that looks like a massive eye. It's beautiful. Mm. I, mm. I paused on the cat on okay. purpose just to see if there was any. I, I I was doing the John Rick dick size version of these last ones. There. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Only John Rick can fuck these things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So from Rudy's playing options, the slushy quicksand, the Baron Harkonnen bathtub thing, God, a wormhole, a black hole, or a cat's eye nebula. Which one of these should go up against our number two seed? Let's start with you, John Rich. Um, I'm gonna pick quicksand, but that uh, the Baron Harkin, whatever it's called, mm -hmm. that's got like magical powers too. Yeah, so like, mm -hmm. it would probably like it probably get you hard, make your dick bigger, like make it bigger. Yeah, I'm not gonna pick yours that can't get because, bigger, because I think quicksand's just a intelligent pick. Yeah, like I mean, you know, there's a little risk there; it could just yeah. suck you in for good. But if you go too deep, it'll get you. Yes, for yeah. sure. That's yeah. So one for quicksand. quicksand. Pat, two for quicksand. Two for quicksand. I'm gonna go Slurpee. Why? It's they're slushy, answer. but well, they're same <laughs> not a big difference. But I don't know. It's like it's freezing cool. cold. It's inviting though. <laughs> what is inviting? It's like a about cold it? plunge for your dick. It's yeah, it's like a polar plunge. Okay. Well, you're telling me in the middle of July you'd rather have that than quicksand. Uh, it, no, I don't think I'd want either, but yeah, I, get, I guess I get what you're saying, KB. Um, qu I think quicksand's the only option here. Quicksand, Rudy. Yeah, I, I, most of mine are ridiculous and unattainable, but I, the quicksand is the one that is, makes the most sense. Quicksand, Nick? When you said quicksand, I had an audible like, ooh, yes. I think <laughs> I have a crush on it. I like, yeah, yeah it, would pull, it would like pull you down, right? Like, yeah. Like, ooh. And I've seen you how excited you get for Ices. I saw it this week. I love Ices. Yeah. I love Coke Actually, Ices. You can like quicksand um, ride you. <laughs> you just go upside down could. in Australia. Yeah, I guess I could. No, no, you got to ride quicksand. It. Yeah, but I, I was thinking you like put like two like planks over the quicksand, then you lay above it, and there's a gap in between. It just it's constant sucking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> and it has a forbidden element, danger. Yeah, yeah it's, mm -hmm. it's 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 forbidden yeah, love. It's, it's, mm -hmm. Wait, really quick, is that a mid two thousands vape next to you, Nick? This is yeah. a vaporizer. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh hell yeah, oh, dude! I haven't seen one of those <laughs> since like high school. I was trying to mm -hmm. for like the past ten minutes. I was like, "Is that a vape that you put actual weed in?" Yeah, that's the funniest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, what a contraption! Every time that we do this, cool. someone from here notices a new thing from your studio. Like that last time, Dana noticed the uh, Drew Brees fucking birthmark on oh, your yeah, screen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> do you have a vape? <laughs> a rig um, vape? Yeah. I'm going quicksand. I have. I think I love it. <laughs> <laughs> you're just yeah. you're in love with quicksand. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Uh, so quicksand's going to go up against the number two seed, uh, and this is a classic one. Uh, you've obviously it's been the movies and all that. Warm apple pie. Uh, we mm. could say any pie really, but warm apple pie was the one that I think is is more fresh on everyone's mind, I guess. Uh, so warm apple pie versus quicksand. Which thing do you want to? <laughs> which thing do you think would be a better lay, uh, Nick? I've never seen any of the American Pies. That's what it's named after the first one. I haven't seen them either. The, the main um, character fucks a pie. I didn't know why I, that I was such a big deal. I don't deal. understand the logistics of fucking a pie. Pies aren't deep. Is he fucking from the side? Uh, the no, he cuts a hole in the in the middle of it. At an angle. I think he goes like, yeah, like if a, this is the bottom, I think he goes like, like kind of like yeah. like that. I don't really know. Kind of across the pie. So the it doesn't do it for <laughs> me. I quicksand. Quicksand, Rudy. Yeah, I'm also going to go quicksand for the same reason that I quicksand to me, it feel less shame. Yeah. But American Pie, once again, has a weird ability to deploy consciousness feel in my mind. Feel less shame fucking the earth yes. than a pie. Yeah. So yeah. quicksand. Also, I think it would feel much better. Yeah. I got it. Mm -hmm. uh, KB? Oh, yeah. Quicksand over wet ass pie. Oh, what is it? What? Apple War pie? Yeah. Whack. Warm apple pie. Warm apple pie. You're sticking yeah, with quicksand. Quicksand. 
Another for quicksand. Thank you. You know, Nick brought some pretty good points about quicksand. Did I just have to go with that? <laughs> Quicksand's going to win, but Pat? I was thinking about doing pie, mm-hmm. but I feel like that the, the pan would irritate the frenulum of my cock. What's a frenulum? <laughs> what? <laughs> so I think I'm going to go with the QS. The QS? Yeah, quicksand for sure. There's no cleanup with quicksand either. That's yeah, it just like absorbs a, your Yeah, nut. that is. And you're gone. Where, no can, can you find quicksand anywhere? I, I think you can make it. Like there's nowhere yeah. naturally we yeah, can go. I started like, that like, room. like we can buy a <laughs> bl- buy a plane ticket and go visit quicksand. People I, walk into the office and step on quicksand as a prank. That would be kind yeah, of fun. I don't know. I'm gonna try and buy I some on you, Amazon. I think you can make it. It's just kind of like mud. Can you make quicksand? It's gotta be somewhere. Yeah. It's gotta be somewhere. You cannot make quicksand. You I, definitely I made can. that up. I said, dude, perfect did they? Can you make quicksand? <laughs> you can. There is naturally natural place with quicksand. It says you can like make Florida, it. You can make Florida and Carolina. You can make like South America. I, I don't think it looks that easy. It's kind of like a flour mixture in this one. I don't yeah. like I don't vibe with that. I, think I want it to be like a sand and dirt type deal. Oh, yeah. Um, okay, Looking before we get up. into the playoffs, let's hear from our next sponsor, Roan Apparel. Uh, men's closets were due for a radical reinvention. Roan stepped up to the challenge. Roan's commuter collection is the most comfortable, breathable, flexible set of products known to men, and here's why. They have a product for every occasion. They help you get ready for anything with the commuter collection, which offers the most comfortable pants, dress shirts, quarter zips, and polos. You never have to worry about what to wear when you're at the Roan commuter collection. Next is that mobility is everything. They have comfortable four-way stretch fabric that provides breathability and flexibility that leaves you free to enjoy what life throws your way from your commute to your uh, work to 18 hour holes of golf, whatever. Uh, looking good is easy. It's time to feel confident without the hassle. They have wrinkle release technology. Wrinkles disappear as you stretch and wear the products, which I love because my shit gets wrinkled all the time. Um, with gold fusion anti-order technology, you'll be smelling fresh and clean all day long. I'm talking to you, big boy. Uh, and on top of that, Roan is 100% machine washable so you can ditch the dry cleaner all together. Uh, we love Roan products here. They're amazing. Have their shirts, wear their pants all the time. The commuter collection can get you through any work day and straight through whatever comes next. Head to roan.com slash bracket and use promo code bracket to save 20% off your entire order. It's 20% off your entire order when you head to roan, R-H-O-N-E dot com slash bracket and use code bracket. It's time to find your corner office comfort. All right. Shout out to Roan. Uh, all right. Playoffs. What would you rather? Well, what's a more fuckable object here? A hot pocket or a McChicken? A food matchup. One for the mm. ages. John Rich. I guess hot pocket. I mean, that's kind of obvious. I don't want it to be too hot, but again, yeah. McChicken's cheap. I think that <laughs> they're both cheap. That's a cheap date. That's true. McDonald's though is like you're gonna get a disease from McDonald's. Mm. Hot pocket, I trust a little bit more. Hot pocket, Pat. I'm going McChicken. Be- McChicken because I think there's more to work with there. Once the yeah. pocket is broken, it's kind of over. Yeah, I guess that's true. Hot pocket, more warm, inviting, easy cleanup. How is it easy cleanup? I mean, it's you in, the pocket. in the pocket. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> KB? I'm going Hot Pocket. Another for Hot Pocket? It's more conducive for penetrating. Mm-hmm. I agree, yeah. It's it's more anatomically built for this. Yeah. Um, as you as we saw in the photo, the still frame, you have to manipulate the McChicken. Mm-hmm. And it's sort of out of its element, I would say. Whereas the Hot Pocket feels like a more natural fit. You could just go around the edges. Yeah. It'd be kind of funny to do one of those like uh, alternate pictures where like you know they say like oh I made like the world's best sandwich and it's like all like it looks weird like there's like giant chunks of bread and that and it's like yeah fuck yeah. the hot pocket but it's just a hole in the middle instead of fucking <laughs> it like a tube. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Nick, if I could, if I'm driving through McDonald's to get this McChicken to fuck, and I could get the fillet of fish bun rather than the bun they used to make. Oh, that's mm. the yeah. sausage bun. Yeah, some tartar. Oh, mm-hmm. some Goated tartar. Fuck. <laughs> it's a good <laughs> Am oh, I allowed? Shit. If I could do a McChicken with a fillet of fish bun, I'm gonna I'm do, go all with out. that. I'll allow it. Okay, then yes, absolutely, McChicken. Four to two fillet of fish bun. Four to two hot pocket though. Hot pocket's gonna move on. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that would be a goaded fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now we have the water snake, which we talked about before, versus the blood pressure cuff that can ride. It, it can, can ride. ride. <laughs> Don't forget. Nick. <laughs> what? The water snakes first. Is, is that what you said? Water snake? Yeah, water mm-hmm. snake. That can ride. They, no, water, no, water snake, snake can't we, didn't, we didn't determine that. Oh. We didn't determine that. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, I guess you... I mean, one of these can fucking ride me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so you didn't have to do anything. You just sit it's there. It's like an X-Factor, dude. It's yeah. a huge X-Factor. <laughs> fucking ride. You come home, long day. Just Takes sit the down in your head. 
Uh, yeah, I'm going to go with the blood pressure cuff that can ride. <laughs> One for the blood pressure cuff that can ride. Rudy? <laughs> yeah, there's something about the riding that gives you uh, a sense of excitement because, you know, it's so one directional when it's just the water snake where I'm making all the motion happen. But the blood pressure, it's almost like you're walking into a room and it's a duel. If I, if, if I got walked in on fucking a water snake, you would think I'm pathetic. If, if you see me land the blood pressure cup that can fucking ride, you think yeah, I'm yeah. the man. Yeah. You see the blood pressure cup on top, yeah. 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 The, yeah. That's what, yeah. yeah. You said it first. Yeah. You're right. It's got to be the blood pressure cuff that can ride. Blood pressure cuff, another one. KB? Yeah, what an epiphany by Phil. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's the... The blood pressure cuff that can mount you and ride your penis. <laughs> the alive, the alive blood pressure. <laughs> <laughs> you know how much blood pressure cuff. Blood pressure cuff. <laughs> it's got it's, again yeah. the riding. It's <laughs> like it's the X factor, if man. Something can ride you. You don't even know. If that's all the pressure is off. All the work is off. <laughs> And you can rationalize it like, oh, this thing might be alive. So I'm taking the blood pressure machine that can ride. It, it is the thought process of walking in on someone. It's getting it's fucking got a quest just... electronics machine. Meek feels fucking this back shit and up. smiling like he found a diamond in the rough. <laughs> six rounds. You fool. Yeah. Uh, you can fucking funny. jackhammer it because yeah. it can ride. <laughs> you prop your feet up. Yeah, you, you prop know. your It can hover above you and you can just. I found Brock does this <laughs> uh, John Rich. Yeah, it's the blood pressure blood pressure cuff to go into just a regular one john uh no it can ride <laughs> Damn. blood pressure cuff versus hot pocket to go into the finals john rich <laughs> Wait. <laughs> it's, you doing, okay why, why, why are we even doing this yeah, we're, hold on let's let's re I'll back up i'll back okay. up it's a blood pressure cuff that can ride i didn't okay. mention it the last time. that's true it's the hot pocket i don't know why we're even bothering with this it's a blood pressure cuff that can right. ride Blood pressure cuff that can it ride. Wins. Yeah, it's the riding for me. <laughs> it's, the, it's the riding. <laughs> They're good Gaby. at riding too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Rudy. Let, let it be. Let, yeah. Nick. <laughs> come on. The blood pressure cuff that can <laughs> ride you is going into the final. And then lastly, before we get to the other side, and you, you're going to need this sponsor by the end of this, uh, BetterHelp. <laughs> a, a lot of us spend our lives wishing we had more time. The question is, time for what? If time is unlimited, how would you use it? The best way to squeeze that special thing into your schedule uh, is to know what's important to you and make that a priority. Therapy can help you find that and help you uh, find what uh, matters to you so that you can do more of it. Uh, if you're thinking of starting therapy, give BetterHelp a try. It is entirely online, designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to your schedule. Just fill out a brief questionnaire and get matched with a licensed therapist. Switch therapists at any time for no additional charge. Use them over COVID. It's super helpful. You could just do it all virtually instead of having to go into an office, which always sucks. Uh, learn to make time for what makes you happy with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash lights today and get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash lights. Thank you to BetterHelp. All right, other side. <laughs> Hollowed out pickle versus pumpkin. Starting with you. John Rich. The hollowed out pickle, definitely. Hollowed out pickle, yes. definitely, no question. But yeah, the picture you showed me was like the perfect thing to fuck. Yeah. Like, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it's hot. Yeah, I guess that's every hollowed out pickle. I don't even know if people hollowed out pickles, mm -hmm. but that. I didn't either. That yeah. wins. Or that wins this round. One for the hollowed out pickle, Pat. I'm going pumpkin. Mm. One for pumpkin. Pumpkin's more thick. So. Well, you can get a pickle oh, that's know. just right for you, too. I know Meek's like a, Meek likes him slim thick, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. The pumpkin's more thick, and like I said, it's all. You can do it inside there, and. <laughs> you can do it inside there. Yeah, you can. The pickle, I mean, you'd have some leakage. <laughs> ah. Yes. Ew, Phil. Leakage. No, it's a great point. There's <laughs> definitely uh -huh. some leakage. Yeah, it's <laughs> not wrong. Wrong. I'm going to go pumpkin. Hell yeah. No, it's pumpkin, KB. I was going to go pickle. I think the picture you sent was perfect. But, <laughs> Phil, you think. Pumpkin? Yeah. <laughs> you think, yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'm going to do pumpkin now. Pumpkin. Mm. Rudy? I'm going to go pickle. It's built for this. The inside of it <laughs> looks, it almost looks like, mm -hmm. it, you know, they were copying something else when they hauled out that mm -hmm. pickle. Yep. Mm. Agreed. It's a spitting image. Three to three to two. Now, Phil, would jack-o'-lantern change this? Well, there's more holes on there, so yeah, an actual... There'd be more more chance of leakage because what if you do it from the back and then it just goes out to the front? 
There's also so more personality. You wouldn't choose the mouth of the jack o' lantern. You would <laughs> no, you'd fuck the back. No, because it's triangles. It's sharp. <laughs> like it's Neo. No, the eyes. Oh, yeah. You want the eyes? Well, it's it's not triangle. Head. You can't put getting head from Ichabod, Ichabod Crane. Ichabod Crane. <laughs> That's a no got, brain. Got an Ipica Capra <laughs> dome on me. Holy shit! That's um, really funny. I think I think with this one, I think the sensations would be pretty similar, and so I'm gonna have to go with what would smell the least. If you if, if a pickle touches your food on a plate, everything tastes like pickle. Your dick is gonna. Oh yeah, mm. your girl's oh. gonna be suspicious mm. for a while. She's yeah. like, did you fuck that pickle from <laughs> vinegary? Yeah, <laughs> but what if she likes pickles? Ooh, that's a great point. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I like pickles. <laughs> yeah, I, I like pickles, and I don't think I'd want a dick to like. If I was sucking a dick, I don't want it to taste like pickle. I want it to taste like dick. How mm. would you suck a dick huh? to taste like pickles? I'd suck a dick that tastes like anything, Phil. <laughs> 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 so you're gonna go with the pumpkin? I'm going pumpkin. I- Ichabod brain. I think that's gotta be yeah. a little bar somewhere. That's tough. Yeah. yeah. Pumpkin's gonna move on. Uh, on the other side, we have quicksand versus the Boston <laughs> cream donut. Nick, quicksand's my personal number one. Your personal number one object you want to fuck? I think it could be. I think it be, could be up against vagina, and I'd have to think <laughs> about it for a little while. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going uh, quicksand. Quicksand, Rudy. Yeah, I was not. I was not a huge fan of the Boston cream donut. I think that quicksand is. I put it there for a reason. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Two for quicksand. Uh, Phil, Boston cream donut sounds like the best option out of the whole crop, right? <laughs> I mean, if you do it there, then you never want <laughs> to eat texture, donuts. The texture, the filling, the whole. Yeah. What do you think? I mean, I was gonna go quicksand just because it could ride you. All right, quicksand. Whoa! No, we did not establish no, that. We didn't that establish back. that. We didn't establish that. We never established that for sure. How? You can't get underneath of quicksand. Yeah. What do you mean? You never tried. Yeah, I think maybe other side Earth of the planet rides you. You're gonna yeah, die. You could get rid- ridden. I by think we're Earth. establishing no riding for the quicksand. Okay. No Only. Okay. Right. I'm going donut. The one for the donut. I'm Me, still, Phil. I'm still going to go quicksand, I think. Phil. Phil. Come on. Quicksand. Breaking his heart. Uh, Pat. Yeah, the Boston cream donut's like sexy. And it's mm. kind of exotic. It's like a special treat. But the QS sucks. So How I'm the go- fuck QS. is a Boston yeah. cream donut more exotic than quicksand, you <laughs> moron? Dude, Boston cream donut has way more sex appeal than quicksand. I you think said exotic. Exotic, exotic. Yeah. exotic yeah, like, is erotic. sex appeal. There's more Boston cream donuts. You mean erotic? Yeah, erotic. I think you mean erotic yeah. in that point. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think... No, like, yeah. sometimes people use them interchangeably, but I think you were going more for erotic than exotic. Well, like, Nick used right. a previous example. If, so, if you walk in on someone <laughs> fucking quicksand, you'd want to save them. If you see someone fucking a Boston cream donut, you'd just think they're a weirdo. You want to yeah. eat the donut. Yeah. Well, <laughs> well, maybe both. Yeah. I don't I know. I just walked better. in on someone fucking quick. <laughs> I want to save this person. Yeah. <laughs> what would you do? It's would you just let it happen? They're dying. Uh, I guess I'm on QS. Quicksand. Yeah, quicksand. Quicksand. Uh, quicksand. <laughs> quicksand versus a pickle. John Rich. Pickle. Uh, uh, wait, pickle. wait, wait, wait. Hold on, pickle. Wait. What'd you say? A quicksand versus a hollowed out pickle. Oh, wait, no, sorry, it's pumpkin. I'm sorry. I, I, miss, I misspoke. Okay. My okay. bad. No, we already did pump. Pu- oh, yeah, pumpkin. Pumpkin one, my bad. Quicksand versus pumpkin? Yes. Quicksand. Quicksand. Easy. Um, pumpkin. One for pumpkin. Oh, is this going to be close? Too much danger with QS. That's fair. I want to go... October is your favorite month. It's not. I guess enough for your team, but it's All your right. favorite. I'm, I'm still going pumpkin. Just easy cleanup. Yeah. Pumpkin. Right. Quicksand's way in. easier clean Quicksand. Clean it's clean, you don't quicksand. have to do anything. Well, what if a quicksand just co- pops back out at you? Yeah. Wouldn't well, quicksand no, do that? Never, never quicksand does. It sucks. Th- that, that capacity, it only sucks. Yeah. It's yeah. not Quicksand could pop back out geyser. There's significantly more cleanup involved for a pumpkin in this case. You have to throw out your cum-filled pumpkin. That's it's you gotta pick the guts up off pit. the ground. Yeah. But well, I, he already chose it. He already, chose. He already picked yeah, it. I already picked, he already picked it. It's I'm been chosen. With pumpkin. Sticking with pumpkin. KB. Quicksand. Why are you going against Meek Phil here? Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't. He has no idea. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Rudy. <laughs> My darling, quicksand. Quicksand three to two. Yep. <laughs> So quicksand versus the blood pressure cuff that can ride <laughs> mm. in oh the finals. Uh, I, everyone thought the two most fuckable objects, quicksand and the blood pressure cuff that can mm-hmm. ride. Uh, starting with you, Nick, which one do you think should win the bracket? All right, quicksand is dangerous. 
You, you probably <laughs> is there quicksand in the U.S.? Yes. Yeah, there is. Mm -hmm. Do we know that? So it's not as. Mm. And on the other hand, the cuff can fucking ride me. <laughs> the mystical object. Yeah. Yeah. Sci-fi. <laughs> I'm going with the uh, blood pressure cuff that can ride me. Wow. W one for the blood pressure cuff that can ride. Rudy? I'm going to go quicksand. Um, simply because I think this blood pressure cuff that can ride is one of one. Yeah, it's like a Harry Potter spell. Yes. Mm. Um, whereas quicksand is rare. But attainable. Okay. And you are at least in isolation. That's fair. It does say quicksand can be found all over the U.S. Oh, wow. I don't get, I don't get it. What don't do you like mean that. it's one of one? Wait, yeah, wait. What does that mean? Like there's uh, only well, one there's, machine? There's, there's only one there's that can ride? I, yeah. It sounds like you're describing like Daenerys Targaryen. Tar Tar but like, what is that? Why is that bad? Wouldn't that make you want it more? Because yeah. it's so rare? Yeah. Well, I'm saying that, like, if someone else has it... Meek. Well, uh, let's ask Meek. You don't want me, sloppy meek. seconds. Let's can you explain the blood pressure cuff that can ride? Yeah. yeah, it just... It's on top of you and it rides you. <laughs> I mean, that's... That I mean, you might that even have to ask. Up. Do you have to, like, ho grab it first and pick it up, or does it do all the work? It does all the work. <laughs> it, like, hovers in my room? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Poltergeist. Mm. <laughs> it's a distant cousin of Towley from South Park. Floats right That's in. what I was. I was literally thinking yeah. that exact Phil, is it same floating? thing. Yes, it or floats. I mean, okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll it's go magic. Like, can you tell that it likes? It's into it. Yeah. Yes. Does it make sense? Wow. The harder it grips. <laughs> oh. Oh. Mm. That could be bad. Yeah. yeah. Fucking it too good. He's got that. Yeah. He's got that gorilla grip. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What's the cleanup like? <laughs> I'll go get your own paper towels, or I guess I don't know. So just like a lady. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, any other questions about the blood pressure cuff from the gallery? No, I think that seals the deal. I'm going with the the blood pressure cuff that can ride and floats and transcend <laughs> 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 space and time. <laughs> Mick, why do you look disgusted by this top? It's something I didn't think about till. Yeah, sure, like same. This, this afternoon. <laughs> I think we can yeah, all yeah, say same. that. Yeah. Well, yep. <laughs> with you there, buddy. Not alone. Yeah. Uh, but me now that you're thinking about it, why does it make you sad? I mean, we spent an hour talking about stuff we'd like to fuck. Yeah. Isn't that <laughs> yeah. Great? That's like up your alley, you know? Mm. Ah, yeah, maybe. <laughs> Just a little bit. Uh, Meek, you're up. Uh, blood pressure cuff. Blood pressure cuff. Wait, can you clarify? That can run. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. <laughs> Bat. I'm, I'm going blood pressure cuff that can ride and float. And float. Yeah. And adjust grip. Yes. <laughs> and adjust grip pleasure. based yeah, on how, how, how into you they are. PBG. Yeah. Yeah. This new one has the PBG. Yeah. Uh, lastly, John Rich. Yeah. Maybe if the quicksand could ride you, but... Unfortunately, it can't. It can't. So I can't even the blood that. pressure cuff will <laughs> win. So the blood pressure cuff that can ride and float and uh, what was it? Pleasure break. What was the acronym we were going for? Pleasure based grip. Pleasure. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> pleasure based grip. Come on, grow up. <laughs> it's gonna win the bracket episode 117. Uh, thank you, to you guys, for joining in. We'll be back next <laughs> week. Jesus Christ! Christ. Thank for, you. For, for a new topic. Yeah.